the fastest short order ship on the West Coast, Chef Taco. Hello, I'm Taco the Octopus, and tonight I'll be cooking your what the heck is that? That would be the new show timer. What? I need more time than that. I was going to make flying barbecued beef ribs. Yes, uh, sorry, um, but we're being preempted by uh, some new talk show they're shooting downstairs. A talk show? Is Rosie back? Yeah, it um, it sounded important. Fine, fine, I can do this. Somebody's going to get fired, but I can do this. Uh, right, think, uh, something quick, something... Crab! <laughs> yes, crab, that most crusty of crustaceans. Crab is a real crowd pleaser and a snap to make when you're in a pinch for time. If you live on the West Coast, crab means Dungeness, fresh from the cold waters of the Pacific Ocean. I know you East Coasters are partial to blues, but for me, dungies are the only way to go. Now, the simplest way to cook a live crab is, of course, to boil it. Just toss it into a pot of heavily salted boiling water, cover, and cook for about 15 minutes. I know that seems a little cruel, but trust me, crab are not bright animals. I mean, really, what self-respecting sea creature would walk into such an obvious trap? Now, if we had more time, I'd love to tell you about buying and storing Dungeness crab, the mysteries of crab butter and imitation crab, and maybe something about reheating cooked crab. Two minutes. But since we don't, I guess we'll just pretend that was 15 minutes. Dismantling a crab can be daunting for first-timers, but it's uh, really not that hard once um, you get the hang of it. Hey, uh, anybody seen a crab? Uh, fellas, let's, let's not be hasty now. Um, uh, I, I'm a celebrity. <laughs> I'm Regis J. Letterman, and welcome to what will undoubtedly be the most important 60 minutes of your life. Oh, oh. 